Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play War Hospital. We're in a bit of a pickle. We have 11 wounded at the clearing station, um, at the casualty clearing station. Uh, at least we're not having, I don't think, any other wounded coming in at the moment, apart from maybe the trains. The problem is also, because the train tracks were destroyed, and we've only just repaired them, we are practically out of freight, which means no more medicine, no more food, well, no more anything. So anything else we have to order by train, which sucks. We have another attack coming, but it's going to take a little bit. So, yeah, this is going to be interesting. We've got people exhausted and tired. We've got lots of food in the making, but it's not going to be enough. Um, because we are soon going to run, see, per hour. So basically, look at this, 23 per hour. So in less than an hour, we're going to run out of freight. And that will be that. So, great. We do have four staff points. Um, so... Sir, engineer is on the way. The problem is, we don't have enough, um space over here for more surgeons um and if you remember we saved that i believe we saved i don't think he died that surgeon that was about to join us so we need to improve the lodgings for surgeons uh we can get another engineer or another nurse for example another engineer would be nice but we already are at the limits of our freight consumption so i don't really see much point in another engineer um and of course, to make the improvements, we need more freight. Uh, so this is medic teams, engineer, staff. Wait. Engineers? Nurses? Medics? Uh, wait, what? What about surgeons? Do we have to improve our surgery, surgery ward? No, that only increases the surgery ward slots. <clears throat> Operation difficulty by... Wow. Fluoroscope is really nice. Um, yeah, how do I... How do I get another... What? Uh, I'm confuzzled now. So we got three out of three surgeons. Uh... Okay. Wait, wait, wait. It's gonna be here, isn't it? Uh, advanced dressing station. Casualty clearing, advanced dressing station. No, rehabilitation, trauma ward. Chemical ward, is it here? Gangrene, removal equipment, anti-tetanus serum, electromagnet, time of operations. Oh, oh, that's really nice. Decreases time of operations by 25%. That would be super awesome. Yeah, but I don't see any improvements here. Um, any improvements here for having more surgeons in there. Low pressure gas tank specialist light system. Yeah. Plus one slot, unlocks a shift system, allows units to be assigned to different shifts to work only in given hours. And I'm not too fond of that for now anyway. So... Yeah, I'm confused. There's no... There's nurse, engineers, and basic staff lodgings. But nothing of increasing... Lodgings for surgeons, so I'm confused. Sir, it seems the patient has lice. We should perform an additional sterilization after his operation is concluded. Um, yeah, let's do an additional sterilization. That also increases our morale, of course. So we've got four patients here. We've got that nurse working, which is very nice. See, oh, see, surgery reward, one idle doctor. But can we not, can we not assign this doctor? See, while these are resting, we cannot seem to assign them here. That sucks. And he's critical. I 
I don't think... Am I gonna die here? Please, sir, uh, don't let me die here. I don't think... I don't know what... Mm, ten hours for this guy, three hours, four hours. <sighs> well, let's see if we can save him. He's critical, though. Not terminal yet. Neither is... So he's got more chevrons, but he's got more difficulty, uh, more failure chance, way more failure chance, and longer operation. And this guy uses one more um, medical equipment, I mean medicine. I'm sorry, my boy. I'm sorry. I'm going to deny care for now. See, that's the problem now. We'll see. We'll see how this goes. Okay, we've got exhausted at the cemetery. Go and rest for now. Exhausted as well. Let's slow this production down now anyway. Yeah, engineer was on the way. Oh, just fix it right. The ADS is understaffed, I know. And of course now there's no one burying bodies. Got 37 buried already let's see the memorial man look at that you know and this is crazy this is like on a very small scale compared to what it actually was how do I do that with no materials um another nurse is now exhausted go to the casualty clearing station please Nurses are on the way. Oh, another complication. Sir, it turned out during the operation that a patient's hip is in a worse state than initially diagnosed. It will take significantly more time to put it back together. Missing improvement fluoroscope. Great. Longer operation. God. We don't need this right now. And he's terminal. And of course, it's the VIP. Great. Wonderful. So that's Henry Sinclair Horn. Yep, great. So now these guys. <clears throat> oh, great. Sometimes it doesn't actually show you the correct. See, now it does. When you move this stuff, it shows you. <sighs> great. Oh, this guy's gonna die. See, and now, it, why does this change? I don't know, for now we're, we're gonna leave it like this. Uh, I cannot amputate here, well, these guys are there anyway, already. I have to amputate here, we just don't have the time here. Okay. <clears throat> Where's the nurse? There are no more raw materials for surgical supplies production. Yep. You go back, and you guys have nothing to do. So, go back. I can't even do any real improvements. Uh, I mean, I could. Sir, nope. engineer is on the way. The ones that only cost um, the war bonds thingy. Like this one, the morgue. The morgue could be quite useful, to be honest. Mm. What else? Could we improve? Uh, could we improve? Allows for performing oxygen inhalation. Now, this is basically like amputation. Um, I'm not exactly... I should really look this up, what this oxygen inhalation actually was. And why does it make people unfit for combat afterwards? Why is it as terrible as... I don't know. <clears throat> Specialist lighting system. All wards increases chance of operation success by 10%. We already have that. Trauma ward. Now, I'm not improving the trauma and the uh, chemical ward because we don't really have enough patients to warrant the investment right now. Uh, this one costs, unfortunately. Uh, advanced dressing station decreases uh, speed of patient condition deterioration. <clears throat> 
two slots for medic teams. We got a casualty clearing station. Surgery ward. I don't really need more slots right now for them there because we don't have enough staff anyway. But it does unlock the shift system. <clears throat> which I'm going to need later on, I guess. All that stuff costs. All of this stuff costs. So nothing I can do here at all. And that's it. Well, increases maximum number of scouts and teams by two. I already don't have enough to hire them. But I'm guessing we're going to need that later. But I would also like to save some of this for ordering extra supplies. Alright, let's just go for this low pressure gas tank. Uh, you're fairly rested. And what else? I suppose hypnosis. Go and do that. An improvement. I think that's about it. Advanced dressing state. I mean, that could be quite useful as well, I suppose. So let's do all of these. And let's see. We are going to run out of... Oh, engineers reached the construction site. Oh, let's see. Um... Was excellent, excellent. So these see the schedule. This one is cargo, of course, and it's cancelled. Great. And this one is going to be delayed. And it's going to be eight more civilians to feed. Great. And then we finally get some freight. Just send me freight. Send me freight. <laughs> um, let's see first. We have operating here. Excellent. And these guys, well, he's critical, so... I think you better go and do this stuff. Sir, doctor is starting a new shift. Um, and over here, well, we have enough for now. And this is bad, yeah. This is bad. Oh, he can keep going here. We'll see how this goes. What? No, no, no. Rest over, th Rest over there. Thank you. <clears throat> yeah, I wish we could get that extra doctor here to just, you know, replace one of these while the other is resting, but I guess that's not possible. So we've got four improvements going on. Sir, patient is cured. Excellent. Let's see what's going on here. Oh, nice. So we're releasing. Sir, we're releasing more people from duty. We could also improve the warehouse, but of course that costs. Yeah, 260. I wonder, you have to start getting more freight a little later on, because this... We're pretty much at the Sir, limit. Medics are on the way. Oh, excellent. Sir, engineers reached the construction site. I think that was a successful operation. Very, very good. Come on, next one. Oh, I really need another medic team there. Come on. Sir, medics way. Go, go, go. Rock and roll. There you go. Hypnosis construction was finished. That was quick. Oh, simplification. Sir, the patient's body appears to have a high tolerance for gas poisoning, as it began to neutralize the toxins on its own. His chances of recovery are much higher than anticipated. Excellent. Administer the normal dosage of the antidote, or administer a smaller dosage of the antidote. Well, let's administer smaller, because it doesn't change anything. I mean, both will have the um, uh, unsuccessful chances decreased. So, excellent. Although we can also have short rehabilitation, but let's just decrease the use of uh, medicine for now. Okay, let's also send these guys to the cemetery, because we've got work to do there. Yeah, see, they're still getting the dead from the trenches. Man, you know, we often play these war games and stuff, and we're like, ooh, this is cool, la la la, and apocalypses and stuff, but I don't think we really realize how, just how bad war can be. And only the people that have actually experienced war, and maybe not even just war, maybe just skirmishes, combat. Now, I, I suppose you could say that is war, but... 
You know, I'm talking like, um, I don't know, insurgent attacks and stuff. But, you know, anything. And just to see your fellow man yeah, on the way. wounded or dying or whatever. That, there's no wonder there's so much PTSD amongst people that do this. It's insane. I yeah, hope. Operation was successful. I hope none of us ever have to experience that, even though I know the world is. Damn it. Oh, denied admission. Sir, operation was successful. I know uh, the world is pretty messed up right now, and it has been for a while. All these freaking wars and everything. It just never ends. It does seem like humanity is not really capable of, um, you know, peaceful coexistent, uh, coexistence with its own freaking kind. So. A lot of the times, I know it's fantasy, but I do, like I said before, I do kind of hope that there's going to be an alien civilization that will just come over here, tell us, yo, you're doing this all wrong, here's how you do it, uplift us, give us good technology, uh, teach us how to actually not war all the time, or at all, and, you know, Sir, operation was accept successful. us into galactic society. Now, of course, that's also the sci-fi nerd in me uh, wishing that, but... Come on. A better future, a better Sir, life. New patient arrived. Good, good, good. Sir, we lost this patient. No. Was it the, uh, no, it's not the VIP. But it was the terminal one, wasn't it? Great. Great. So he's resting now. If he was to continue, he would be extremely, he's already exhausted. So he might as well yeah, go and rest. We've got a trauma ward patient, and we don't have any medicine. He's in good condition. See, they have to get. Sir, a message for you just arrived. Oh. Finished rehabilitation. Excellent. Ah, there he is. There's the surgeon, <clears throat> Major Henry Wells. Your facility saved my life, and with Lieutenant Krumer's suggestion, I want to offer my services as a surgeon to the hospital. No room for the unit to join. I know! How do I do it? Decline for now. No. Sir, patient is cured. How do I get more space? Um, okay, I have to go through all of this stuff again. I'm really sorry. Let's see, housing doesn't really do anything here. Medic teams? They're not a medic team. Medic team? Medic team. Nurses? Nurses? Engineers? Engineers? And... Rest time. And rest time. So... Yeah. <clears throat> I don't see anything... That will allow us... To have more surgeons. See, there's... Ah, wait, 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 wait. This this is what I need, not... Well, no. I need to house them. This only gives you more slots. So maybe after the end of this these five days, but that's going to be too late. Man, this sucks. It's an expensive unit as well. Really expensive. Oh, lots of people ready. Uh, we're going to release you from duty. Xiangzhou. Uh, we're going to send you to HQ. Shilton. Uh, Westbrook, you're going to be released from duty. Alan, you're going to go to HQ. And Norman, you're going to go to HQ. Uh, all of our team... These guys are extremely exhausted. Uh, okay. We can go back here. The nurses are okay for now. Let's go to the op... No, not yet. Actually, yes. Go to the operating ward. And uh, we'll relieve the other one. Nothing we can do here. Because all of this stuff uses um, freight. All of it. So, nothing we can do. Uh, scouts. Okay. Staff lodging. Doctors. Records five. Yeah. Awaiting tasks. But I can't get them. 
Wait, uh, wait, what's his name? Sir, medics are on the way. <clears throat> uh, Gerard Lemaitre. Uh, Gerard Lemaitre. Uh, oh, he's not even here. Okay. But he's a surgeon, right? Joins hospital staff. As a surgeon. Yeah, he's a surgeon. How do I do this? No idea. I mean, maybe this these slots are what I need. And that it automatically increases the slots for surgeons uh, at the staff lodging. That's possible, but there's no way I can do this. Even if I had the freight right now. I mean, yeah, then I could do it, but... Mm. Died after being denied admission. Great. Okay, so you can go and rest now. Sir, nurses are on the way. Okay, let's see. Oh, there's someone here needing help. Am I gonna die here? Please, sir, don't let me die here. Um, right. These guys are still okay. He's still operating. Jeez. Man, that really sucks. I really want another free surgeon. That would be such a boon. Sir, medics reached the cemetery. Sir, it appears the toxin did not have time to spread throughout the body, yet, and the poisoning was only mild. Patients' hopes of survival are significantly higher than expected. Follow normal procedure or sodium hypochlorite washes. Increased cost, but shorter operation. Yeah, just normal procedure. Nothing else we can do at the Sir, moment. New patient arrived. Serious. Oof. Eight hours and... I'm sorry, Viva Nela. I have to deny this care. I just don't have the the medical equipment nor the time. And we're running so low now. Extremely exhausted. Okay, go over there. Cemetery. Okay, you go over here because these guys like being in the cemetery. Uh, right, she's exhausted as well. Great. Sir, medics are on the way. Hurry, he doesn't have much time left. Sir, medics are on the way. Doctors cannot operate because there is not enough medicine. I know. Wait, there's three wounded again? What's going on? There's a train. Thanks for nothing. Wait, no, no, no. Oh, no, this was... No, thank you. That was the, um... That was the one with, um... Supplies. Woo! Supplies, everyone, work, work. Okay, does not have any preference. Go, go, go. All right, we need this. We need more food. Uh, but we also need some of this. So I'm going to make more food and more of this. Okay, go, go, go. Man, this is going to go down quick. Reach the engineering depot. Go, my lovelies. Produce. Produce. Oh, great. They're bringing in more Sir, casualties. Operation was successful. Oh, that's what it is, I guess. Oh, jeez. Just serious conditions everywhere. Three hours. Four hours. I have to deny care here. I will be better, sir. Just don't let me die. I'm sorry, boy. I'm sorry. It's serious. Amputate here. Serious condition as well. That's gonna be too late. It's gonna be exhausted. We could... We could do this. A little faster, a little more. Uh, this guy's here as well. Uh, he's only lightly wounded. I can't just deny care. Oh, freaking. Oh, that's. There's just no way, is there? 
Well, he'll have to stop resting and do this stuff. He's gonna be exhausted here. He's already extremely exhausted. There's no way. <sighs> He's stable. He's stable. But he's lightly wounded. I cannot just let him die. How do you pronounce it? Hongshi... Hongshi Poo? Um... We've got two serious patients... Three serious patients here. If we amputate here... But they're only lightly wounded. I can't do this to them. I know, I know. I'm not thinking of game terms. But I'm I'm trying to think like you know like <laughs> like this is actually happening like uh, like I'm the doctor or the one deciding the fates of these people. That must have been a shitty job when they were you know triage. Um, this is all too late. All too well, but he's extremely exhausted. He's just going to collapse. I cannot take this risk. Gonna be extremely exhausted and work on him. But then we risk Nicholas Jones collapsing. You know what? Better than to let him die, I'm going to amputate. Despite how horrible this is for yeah, light wounds. I just wish we could get that extra doctor. Why can I not improve this? Maybe this is gonna open up more. Staff. Creepy music again. Okay, uh, nurses. You're exhausted. Get over here. Nurses are on the way. Sir. Okay, you go and rest. Operation was successful. Uh, let me just check. Okay, we have six for now. So we're going to... Yeah, just let him rest. So we're going to stop uh, producing this medicine for now and produce more food because we really need it. <clears throat> and maybe just have everyone produce that. There. Oh, what's going on? Oh, Widow, three children. She joined the army in August 1914 and clearly remembers having to wait with the other nurses for the first months of the war before the commanders allow them to serve at the front. I mean, of course, because she's a woman. So they... I'm guessing that was a thing. They didn't uh, want women um, serving in the army, so to speak. Um, resilient. Tires significantly less at CCS. See, this stuff is nice, but we would always make have to make sure that she actually is there and works there. Others working with them tire less. Morale slightly increases when they work. Works significantly better when working with others. Let's do resilient then. Let's do resilient. So that's... Wait, that's her, right? Yeah, she's, she's in the CCS. Okay. <clears throat> oh, close to collapsing. Get back. Advanced dressing station. We still need them there, I believe. Sir, medics are on the way. Wait, what did it say? Waiting for medic teams in trenches too. Okay. They are working, right? Yeah, wounded in the trenches. Okay. Wounded in the trenches still. Sir, the patient suffers from a severe case of trench foot. If not treated, the patient's feet may sustain permanent nerve damage. Ignore the trench foot, perform amputation, will no longer be fit for duty, or perform procedure to save the patient's feet. Oh man, longer operation. We really, really, really cannot... We're, he's already on amputate. We cannot afford a delay here. Other people are going to suffer. Sir, medics are on the way. <clears throat> 
Anyway, thank you very much okay. for watching. The I hope you're all enjoying this. Um, a big thank you to my patrons, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye. Yeah.